Hello. Today we will be putting up mealworm and darkling beetle, which they're the same species, but darkling beetles are the adult version of mealworms. What you want to do if you're gonna need like a terrarium for them, kind of for feeding scorpions, <clears throat> you kind of want to get a bigger tank than for the for the mealworms than the adults, because mealworms take up a lot more space and what you're always gonna want to do is always put a couple pieces of lettuce in there maybe a little bit of sanctuary but that's about it for the adults you you need a thin covering of sand just enough for the so they can grip on unlike the mealworms which need to be thick so they can grow, crawl through and also for the adults you're gonna need to make almost a kind of home for them a little base where they can hide in but first I'm not really gonna do that because we have if you do have pupa and I'll, I'll go get it real quick if you do have pupa that are wa that are waiting to become adults like this one right here you might want to keep it in a little cuppy until it comes fully adult and that way it will be safe and do not keep it with the mealworms or it will eat the, the pupa. And don't keep the adults with the mealworms because they will eat. Because the mealworms will eat the adults, which happened to me once. Not, it did not happen, did not go very well. So I'll just be setting this up. You do not, you don't really need to feed the adults as much as the mealworms. It, it, it's not that bad. And that... That's pretty much a set for, for darkling beetles. Thank you. Phew. Goodbye.